It used to be that sails powered all seagoing vessels. But the advent of motorized boats largely eliminated the need to rely on the wind, and most sail designs now are for yachts and leisure purposes. Today, environmental issues demand a shift to renewable energy. To achieve dramatic cuts in fuel consumption, the Wind Challenger project aims to develop a hybrid ship that relies on sails for its main driving power, but is also equipped with an auxiliary propulsion system. After several simulations, we achieved an average of 20% energy savings compared to a conventional motorized ship when traveling between Yokohama and Seattle. And although sailing with the wind means traveling a greater distance, selecting such a course consumes an average of 30% less energy. We used a roughly half-sized model of the sails to conduct a demonstration test on land and gather different data. A unique feature of these sails is that they can be lifted and lowered, making it possible to create larger sails. We used a two-meter-long model ship for a tank test it also confirmed that unfurling the sails will not capsize the vessel. Our team chose to place four sails on an 80,000 deadweight Panamax bulk carrier as the standard vessel. But ship owners may choose to use a different number of sails depending on the budget and the amount of desired energy savings. This is a 180,000 deadweight cape size bulk carrier outfitted with nine sails. The automatic sails are equipped with sensors that tell them when to extend, retract, and rotate, depending on wind strength and direction. Peripheral technologies, such as strong yet lightweight compound materials, reliable control systems, and more accurate wind predictions are also evolving. Together, these innovations enabled the Wind Challenger project to create the maritime vessels of the future.